everyone so we're basically going to be cleaning up these tiles and, and all the rendered walls here across this this pool area as you can see they're a terracotta sandstone tile it's a very porous tile so I'm not expecting it to come up completely <laughs> like, like new never expect existing pavers or surfaces to come up like new but these specifically uh, hold a lot of mold and when you look at how deep the mold has gone in here it's going to be problematic to get that out but we'll do the best that we can but I want to show you this before so you can see that it's all around here and we're cleaning up all these rendered walls as well so give you a feel for that okay so the first process is as always with this kind of work is spraying the chemical getting that clean and crisp um, so here we go everyone so this is uh, the final results I'm absolutely wrapped with it I can't tell you how happy I am with this um, the only thing I can say is that uh, I'm lucky that the mold hadn't gone too deep into the stone and um, the customers have actually stayed on top of it but if you look at all the walls come up beautiful absolutely gorgeous and then all of the pavers have come up just absolutely gold around all the mold that was around here um, behind the Buddha I mean it was just you couldn't even see hardly the tile so really happy with the results and so is the customer um, and as I said to you before you know this when, when with these pavers the mold can go deep and these th this is an example of where it's gone deep but fundamentally if you look at where we started to where we've got it and if you if you have these kinds of pavers you, you do need to maintain them so bear that in mind, we'd be happy to help and give us a call if we can help you.